Hi guys, and welcome back to another art video, and this is a little acrylic painting video. I haven't done an acrylic painting on my channel before, I believe. Um, I had just been doing some acrylic painting in art class, and I was just super inspired to do some acrylic painting, and um, hopefully I can get back into like painting on canvas with like opaque paints, I guess. I do paint, I paint with watercolor, but um, I don't know. Acrylic paints and oil paints are definitely a lot different than watercolor because they're opaque and the mixing process is a lot different obviously because watercolors you mix them with water and um, water them down and you use paper. But um, I'm excited to get back to doing things on canvas. I think the reason that I kind of veered away from it subconsciously is that I was afraid from like ruining a canvas because for some reason a canvas just feels like more of a valuable thing than a piece of paper um I don't know why that is I feel like it's just because it is a like thick like thing even though they're not super expensive I believe you can buy them for like five dollars for a pack of three which I guess is sort of expensive if you're on a budget but I don't know I don't know if it's the expensive thing it just feels like a commitment whenever you're painting on a canvas like this has to turn out good I can't mess up that kind of thing but I'm just really excited to start some more acrylic painting and I guess even though it is on a canvas it's not super permanent because you can just with acrylic paint you can just paint over it since it's opaque so you could just paint over your mistakes and just keep reworking it until you get it right like I guess that's a difference between acrylic and watercolor, if that makes any sense. I'm sorry if I'm rambling. Um, it is currently 11 p.m. on a Sunday night, and I'm trying to get this video up hopefully Monday. I don't know if it's, it might be Tuesday by the time this video goes up. It's super late. This video is supposed to go up on Friday, but I was busy with band things. Um, the schedule that I'm on right now is just kind of crazy. Uh, we don't get off of school until 5.30 and then we, by the time we drive home and everything, it's usually uh, getting near 6. And then on Tuesday and Thursday I have band practice after school which lasts till 7. And then I have to drive home from that as well. And then on Friday I go to football games which last till past 10 o'clock I believe. So as you can tell I don't have a whole bunch of time for YouTube and I'm sorry about that I don't know I really want to get back into doing YouTube videos like consistently I don't think I'm gonna be able to stick to the Friday schedule anymore but I will try to get up videos as often as I can or as frequently as I feel is like necessary and my main thing with YouTube is that I want to be proud of videos I don't just want to spew out videos for the sake of having a video up that week so I want to be proud of every video that I upload so for example I tried to record the commentary for this Saturday morning, but I just really was not in the right mental state to do it. I was super tired and I was very rambly and not making much sense. So I just decided to scrap that and I decided that I would rather have up a video later than to have it not be good or make any sense at all. So I hope you guys are okay with that. Um, and yeah, this is... I guess I should talk about the idea behind the painting. It is a, it's just a very basic um, copy of the SpongeBob house, the pineapple house that you see in SpongeBob. And I've just always really liked the style of SpongeBob. I like how, um, even though it is digitally animated, I believe, the background is very like painterly and it almost looks like it's some kind of oil painting or something. And like the opening scene, um, like the island, you know? It's very like oil painting-esque. It might even be an actual oil painting. I'll have to look that up. I don't know if that's a real thing or not, but that would be really cool if they did like traditionally paint the backgrounds. That would be really awesome. I don't, they might not, but I just really like the painterly style and how you can see the brush strokes and everything. So I decided that I wanted to do an acrylic painting of the SpongeBob pineapple. Um, also because my friend Olivia requested that I do something Spongebob themed and I realized that it would be a good idea for a fan art piece since I do like doing fan art, um, but I'm not like, I, I always struggle with what to draw fan art of because I usually just, um, default to Steven Universe, <laughs> but I guess it was a good idea to do a Spongebob piece because I've never done that before and I actually did a watercolor painting for her, which was, um, and it was nice of her that she actually paid me for it so that was super cool 
I didn't expect that at all. So thank you, Olivia, if you're watching this. Um, and yeah, so this is my SpongeBob pineapple piece. I'm getting rambly again after after my little spill about oh, I want to put up good quality videos, not rambly ones. But at this point, I'm just like I'm just gonna get up a voiceover. I really do not care. I mean, I do care. I don't. <laughs> I do care, I promise, but, um, yeah, I don't, I'm, I'm okay with this. Are you okay with this? Hopefully we're all on the same page and we're okay with this. Um, but yeah, I just thought it would be really cool to do an acrylic painting video because I really like it, the way it looks whenever paint mixes and stuff. Um, I did a little, like, real-time paint mixing at the beginning of the video. I hope you enjoyed that. But even, like, the paint mixing on the canvas looks really nice to me. Like, whenever you put, like, um like a blob of like stark white and then blend it out I feel like that looks really neat to watch on video I don't know hopefully you guys enjoyed this video I think I'm gonna go ahead and sign out now because it is getting late and I'm super tired oh also one other thing I should mention I changed settings during this video it was one day after school and I was just kind of tired and I just felt like relaxing and doing something relaxing so I brought this painting downstairs and worked on it and yeah so if you see people walking around in the background that's why that is because I'm just painting at my dining table but it was fun um, I just set up my camera on a chair in the, in the dining room so yeah it was super cool um, I might do some like casual painting videos or sketching videos where I'm like sketching on my couch I feel like that could be a cool thing to do um, and yeah, but that's all the time I have for this video. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed the video and let me know if you want me to do some more acrylic paintings or something like that. Or if you have any suggestions, I might not get to all of them, but if you, if I like it, maybe, I don't know. Um, but yeah, thank you all for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.